channel so of course today is another weekly vlog i did already insert some clips from earlier in the week but it is friday the 16th it's about like 4 30 and i'm getting ready to wind down from work i'm about to do a yoga class on peloton live actually and as you saw i baked some muffins earlier today and just had like kind of a chill day. Tonight, um, Ryan's sister is actually coming over to our place. We were gonna go out to the pool, but it's actually like 101 right now outside and a UV index of 11, which is just asking for, oh, I noticed a little fuzz, for a sunburn. So we're not gonna do that. Um, we're just gonna like cook dinner and relax and hang out. So that's the plan for Friday night. And then tomorrow, I would love to make it out to Bath and Body Works in Katy. Uh, it's gonna be 101 again tomorrow, so I don't know if we're gonna be doing much outdoor activities for like the next week because Texas is getting like a huge heat wave and it's supposed to be hundreds um, for the next like, week. So I have to be really careful with Kai. He's been having some problems going outside recently, um, just being able to last without panting too hard and, and going super, walking super slow. So we have to be really careful with him going out when it's this hot outside. If you have any tips for dogs, let me know. I'm looking into like a cooling vest for him, which you can like um, get wet or freeze it. So it like gives them some cooling effect, hopefully, and maybe some dog booties. So let me know if you guys have any suggestions on what you do for your pets when it's hot outside. But that's a couple things that I found on like initial research. So I'll probably get some of those for him soon. Anyways. That's it for the updates for now. Nothing exciting going on this weekend. Like I said, we're probably not going to leave the house because it's so freaking hot. So that's the plans. Um, Sunday is Father's Day, so happy Father's Day. We are going to go see family for that. And we will see Ryan's parents. And I think that's all the updates that I have for you guys for now. Tomorrow, um, I really want to go to Bath & Body Works. I really want to film for you guys some more content for SAS. I know it's like dying down, but I just really want to go to my outlet store. So I think I'm going to do that tomorrow and I'll keep you guys updated. So I will see you all later. Hello guys, it is currently Saturday, it is about noon, and I am pretty much done getting ready. I actually have to do a couple more coats of mascara, but we are headed to the outlet mall today. Um, I wanted to get a video in of the outlet mall near me in Houston um, at the uh, Katie Mills Mall. Before SAS finishes, I wanted to get a um, store walkthrough video up and possibly a haul. I literally don't need anything, but the outlet is kind of like Marshalls. You walk in not knowing what you need and then it kind of tells you what you need. So we'll see how that goes. I really do need hand soaps, wallflower refills, and mini body care. So I'm hoping to find that. Um, I definitely don't need to buy any more candles because I actually have a little more than I'm comfortable with and I haven't finished a single candle in the month of June yet so I really need to get working on that but yeah the goal was actually to be there right when they open at 10 but I slept in today because yesterday we had like a whole fun dinner and a movie night um, with Ryan's sister she came over okay literally Ryan and his sister they used to live together and cook together all the time. They are the best chefs that I know. Um, just one of those people that, you know, um, people that cook and they don't need recipes and they just kind of know what goes together and what will taste good. Like Ryan could make an amazing five course breakfast out of just the basic stuff we have in the fridge. I don't know how it's possible, but it's possible. So they are both like that and it's awesome to like watch them cook and stuff. And I helped out a little bit. I made cookies. 
<laughs> but uh, cookies and, and drinks, so you know, there's that. But yeah, they were just having so much fun cooking yesterday and it was amazing what they made. So I did show some footage of that for you guys. And then we watched um, Shazam 2, which was a very long movie, but it was still pretty funny. I've actually never seen Shazam 1, so I'm not much of like a DC Comics girl. I've never watched most of their movies. So Ryan really likes DC stuff. So we've been watching it for the past couple of days. So yeah, just finishing getting ready and then I'm gonna head over. I already had breakfast, so we shouldn't have to stop for anything, but I'm just gonna go straight to the mall. I might go to um, Victoria's Secret and Pink because they're having their semi-annual sale right now too. Um, so I just like to pop in and see what they have. And we also have a Marshalls in there. So I'll just check out what they've got. And I'm looking for a bathing suit maybe for vacation, but I really don't need to buy anything else. I am going to get on the road and head to the mall and I will see you guys when I get there. Hello guys, we are at the mall now. I'm about to head in and I have a few stores that I wanna visit. So hopefully I won't like take too long, but it is already one o'clock. So I definitely need to head inside. So let's go in.
I grabbed Froyo on my way out. So I'm eating my Froyo in the car. It's 102 degrees outside. And a lot of people are passing by my car. But I'm just going to sit here, eat my Froyo. I do have a little haul for you guys, which I'll do at home. Um, but I did not get anything at Bath & Body Works. They did not have good stuff. So that was pretty disappointing coming all the way out there for that. But I got some other stuff, so that's okay. So I'm going to eat this and then head home. Okay, guys. I am now back home. And I need to drink a lot of water because I have like a heat headache. I don't I don't know if you guys have had this before, but just like driving in my car with the sun exposure gave me a headache. So I'm gonna drink some water. Um, I did wanna also say we have Mia back today. We're actually bringing her over to Ryan's parents tomorrow on Father's Day because they're back in the country. She don't wanna look at the camera, Mia. Oh, she's so sweet. So say goodbye to the camera, Mia. We won't see you for a while, okay? Oh, she's so sweet. But anyways, let me turn you guys around and show you what I got. Bath & Body Works was a bust. I did not get anything there. I also did not get any body care at Victoria's Secret or VS Pink. I just got swimsuits, so I will show you what I got. Okay, so the first store that I bought stuff from was Victoria's Secret. I got two swimsuits. So cute. So this one's like a bright candy apple red. You can't really tell. It's looking different on the camera, but... This is a bright candle candy apple red bathing suit. Super cute. It's really comfy and honestly, like I feel like this is a good, like comfy bathing suit. It's not necessarily like the cutest thing in the world, but it's actually very flattering with this one shoulder and the cutout. Um, but yeah, this one was on sale for $25. So really good deal. And then I got this two-piece set. So stinking cute. It looks like the French Riviera. That's what it reminds me of. But um, the bottoms were $11.98 and the top was $17.98. So I did really good at Victoria's Secret. I spent a total of 60 bucks. And then I did get this button down for Ryan from Express. He usually gets a new button down like every vacation. So this is his little vacay button down. And the last store that I got stuff from was J. Crew. So I got us both some shorts. I got him some seersucker swim shorts. These are the J. Crew Flex swimwear. I just thought this was the cutest little pattern and everything. So I picked these up for him. And then I got myself these like linen shorts. I'm not really the biggest fan of linen pants. I think they look kind of frumpy on me because I'm shorter. Um, also pants in the summertime in Texas is not a good idea. So I picked up some shorts instead and I was going to get them in like the classic linen like cream color, but they were very see-through. So I picked them up in this, I think this is black and white um, stripes and it was 54 on the tag, but I think I paid $16.98. And also on Ryan swim shorts, they were $33.00. And then I picked up some beautiful jewelry. They had the cutest jewelry out. And I honestly was tempted to buy everything, but I would have spent like $200 on jewelry. So I only bought three things. I did pretty good. So I got this beautiful pearl necklace and matching pearl earring set. This is so, so pretty. And I was obsessed with pearls last year. I got like a cheapy version of this, but I think this will last me quite a few years because it's a J. Crew, like actually feels like good quality. <laughs> piece of jewelry so the necklace was $16.83 and the hoops were $15.13 and then these small hoops were $13.42 and these are just really pretty dangly hoops so oh I'm obsessed I'm gonna be wearing these three pieces all summer long all right well I'm gonna get changed and go do a spin class at the gym downstairs in our um apartment complex and then I think Ryan and I are gonna try to do something for dinner tonight and get out of the house. So it's gonna be fun. So I will talk to you guys later. Hello guys, you can see Kai's head right there. It's currently Sunday night. We just got back home. It is almost 9 p.m. and we went and visited my um, aunts and cousins today for Father's Day, aunts, uncles, cousins. Um, for Father's Day, it was also my dad's birthday. Today, no, tomorrow on the 19th is his birthday. So we celebrated both of those occasions today and had a really good time. Just a lot of mingling with family and good food and stuff like that. So that was really fun. We also saw Ryan's, Ryan's parents, hello, um, because they just went on a month long 
trip and we brought back Mia to them. So Mia is now gone. I'm so sad. Um, she's so cute, but we brought Kai back. So he's back here with us and we are back home. I wanted to show you a quick overview of like my outfit, my hair for today. You can't really tell because my hair is so dark, but I just had it naturally curly. And now of course it's all frizzy because it was like a hundred outside today, but I had these little braids in and I'm wearing actually the new shorts that I just got from J. Crew. So this was like a really comfy fit today. This is an uh, American Eagle little like waffle knit lettuce edge crop top and then these little linen shorts from J. Crew. and I was wearing just like flip-flops. So yeah, I felt really cute and very comfy today since it was so hot. Um, I mean, we didn't spend that much time outside, but still. I just didn't want to be warm, but anyways, I'm going to take off my makeup and um, shower and get ready for bed, but I'm actually off of work for Juneteenth, um, and then I do have a haircut at one, so yeah, that's what tomorrow's going to be. So I guess I will see you guys tomorrow, and um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hello guys, it is currently Monday, June 19th, and it is Juneteenth, so I'm actually off of work today. So I am headed, it's about one o'clock, it's almost one. I have a haircut at one, so I'm leaving right now. I just dropped off Kai with my mom just to watch him for a few hours. And yeah, let's go get our haircut. And then I will probably head to the Bath and Body Works next door to my Ulta that I go get my haircut at um, and check out what they've got. So let's get going. Okay, so here is the before of my hair. Of course it is curly, so it's gonna look different. She's gonna blow dry it, but here's my longest layer right now and my hair is down to here. So I'm definitely gonna cut a little off and get my layers back. And here is the after, it's perfect. I told her I wanted to keep some length. So it's still longer. I usually go about right here every haircut. So it's a little longer, but we got my little face framing back, which is basically curtain bangs, but not as short and my layers. And she honestly has been upping the blowout game. Like every time I go, her blowout is better and better. So. Yeah, very happy with that. And I did pick up a um, new moisturizer for Ryan. This is the CeraVe with 30 SPF for him. So picked that up because he's been needing to wear SPF during the day. So picked him up that. Now we're gonna head to Bath and Body Works real quick and see if I can find anything. And then we will head home. Hello you guys, it's a little later in the day, it's like five o'clock, I just finished a workout, it's actually almost six, and Ryan just got home from work, but look what he brought home with him. He bought me, well us, a yoga mat from Lululemon, you guys. This is like the best quality I've ever seen. This is the exact type, the mat five millimeter, and here's the dimensions. It's really, really big, but it's very solid and stable, and it's this really pretty blue marble color, so oh my gosh, I love it. It's so pretty. And also he brought something home today that I actually got from one of his coworkers. So Ryan's coworker turned now like our friend is, um, or she, we and her were talking about beauty products. And then I was saying like, oh, my blow dryer broke. And I'm thinking of getting like the shark flex. And she was like, I'll sell you mine because I don't use it. So guess what I got you guys. So I have a shark flex style. I'm so excited to try this out. I got a blowout today during my haircut, so I'm not gonna use it 
today or tomorrow, but whenever I wash my hair next, I will use it and I will include uh, what I think my first thoughts in a vlog, but you guys, oh, I'm so excited. It's really awesome. Oh, it's so cool looking. So yeah, and then it also comes with the little like curling attachments. There's one for each um, side that the curl is gonna go on. So there's one that goes this way and then one that goes this way, if that makes any sense. Um, so yeah, very excited. So on that note of some exciting purchases, I'm gonna end this vlog and um, edit tonight to go up tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Just like a nice chit chatty um, with a little bit of like baking and cooking in there. Just like a really nice weekend. And I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.